Breaking news coming in right at the top. It's the internal tussle between the BJP and the RSS that's now sparked a massive slugfest over Hindutva. It's been four days since the RSS laid down the law for the BJP on returning to its core saffron ideology for the 2014 campaign. Today, the party has been forced to publicly endorse that diktat despite what sources call apprehensions with it. हिंदुत्व की विचारधारा सांस्कृतिक राष्ट्रवाद की विचारधारा को लेकर ही भारतीय जनता पार्टी ने अपनी राजनीतिक यात्रा प्रारंभ की है और जो हमारी अपनी विचारधारा के प्रति प्रतिबद्धता कमिटमेंट हमारा पहले था जब हमने यात्रा प्रारंभ की थी भारतीय जनता पार्टी के रूप में वही कमिटमेंट आज भी अपनी विचारधारा के प्रति हमारे हमारा है और हिंदुत्व के विचारधारा के संबंध में मैं दो टूक शब्दों में स्पष्ट कर देना चाहता हूं यह विचारधारा इंसान और इंसान के बीच नफरत पैदा करने वाली विचारधारा नहीं है देखिए राष्ट्रवाद गुड गवर्नेंस विकास हमारा मुद्दा है था और रहेगा और सुशासन के माध्यम से अंत्योदय आखिरी आदमी के विकास का संकल्प हमारा शुरू से रहा है संघ के साथ समय समय पर मार्गदर्शन ले, लेना हमारे लिए गर्व की बात है इसके ज्यादा कुछ नहीं Let's get a word in from headlines today is Atish Srivastava for more on this Atish what is the more, what is the conflict here why is the BJP uh, feeling compelled to clarify on this tussle between itself and the RSS over this return to Hindutva Well so they basically realize that it is going to be very difficult to follow Hindutva hard line because that is not the issue is because bjp may even believe that the polarizing voters may not really help them at this juncture they can do it nearing lok sabha elections but at this point in time when they discuss in the draft they need to talk about the not that hard line in the so that is what the confusion is and that is why bjp is issuing a clarification that been following what rsc has been saying and the, 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 the good governance still happens to be a top of the agenda because the party of definitely two view that what kind of it was should be followed whether it should be a hard stand as they took to during 92 to 99 that is what uh, they should be doing or they should take a much softer stand from uh, which they take a from 2003 atish thanks for getting us that insight here are some of the other uh, all right uh, rajnath singh has actually come out and said and has actually made a statement on this apparent divide between the RSS and the BJP, here's what he said. Hindutva ki vishardhara, sanskritik rastwaat ki vishardhara ko lekar hi Bharati Janta Party ne apni raimiti ki atra prarambh ki hai. Aur jo hamari apni vishardhara ke prati, prati baddhata, commitment, hamara pahle tha jab hamne yatra prarambh ki thi Bharati Janta Party ke rup mein, wahi commitment, aaj bhi, अपनी विचारधारा के प्रति हम, हमारे हमारा है और हिंदुत्व के विचारधारा के संबंध में मैं दो टूक शब्दों में स्पष्ट कर देना चाहता हूं यह विचारधारा इंसान और इंसान के बीच नफरत पैदा करने वाली विचारधारा नहीं है इट इज द इंटरनल टसल बिटवीन द बीजेपी एंड द आरएसएस दैट हैज स्पार्क्ड दिस एंटायर लेवल ऑफ डिसकंफर्ट विद द बीजेपी फीलिंग कंपेल्ड टू क्लैरिफाई एंड व्हाट रियली इट्स प्लेटफॉर्म इट्स प्लैंक is really going to be as far as the 2014 election is concerned. If there has been a level of turmoil over the last seven to eight months within the BJP, a crisis of leadership, the exit of Nitin Gadkari, the entry of Rajnath Singh, he himself is an RSS man. But where do things actually stand as far as the ideology issue is really concerned?